What's up? It's been way too long, ain't it? It's been way too long. I'm sorry, y'all. I've been incredibly busy. Uh, moved to a different house. Uh, it's been like, what's the last time? I last time I made a video, I was in a freaking hotel while now. I'm making like a Florida State pre season preview video. But I'm finally in my new house, a uh, little man cave in the garage. Uh, it's, it's pretty cool. I'll, I'll, I'll take a video of it later and put a, put a new video out there for y'all to see, uh, see my new man cave. But I'm going to try to make a video every week. I will. I want to make a video every day, you know, saying this and that. But I just ain't got the time, if I'm being honest. So I'll, I'm going to start making a video just every Sunday afternoon, every Sunday night. Uh, just going over the week of games and what's what's to look forward to. Uh, mm, dang, my arm's getting tired. Uh, let's see. Um, Georgia. We'll start with Georgia. Don't mind the mattress. Uh, we'll start with Georgia. Uh, they um, they beat Auburn forty-two to ten. They had a rough rough start of it. It was zero to zero going in the second quarter, wasn't it? Like, what are we doing? A little worried there for a second, but we uh, we came out in the second half and did what we do. Uh, great running game. I mean, how many yards did we finish rushing? Two over 250, right? I could be wrong. Uh, Edwards had a good game. Brian, uh, Brian Robinson, or, or what's his name? Last name Robinson. I forgot his first name. I could hit his point, number 22. Anyways, he had a good game. Uh, Stetson had an all right game. Uh, he had that 65 yard touchdown run. Damn. Oh, good Lord, that boy can run. Uh, he did all right passing in the second half. Um, he did lose that fumble at the beginning of the third quarter, but it is what it is. We won 42 to 10. The defense played great. Um, you know, going into next week, uh, Vandy, I'd like to see Georgia get out to a uh, faster start. Because after Vanderbilt, we, uh, we got some pretty tough games coming up. I mean, Florida, they're not really that good, but I mean, it's Florida and Jacksonville. You never know. I don't think nothing will even, I don't think, I don't think that game will be close. I think it'll be more like 42 to 10, if I'm being honest. But after that, now we play Tennessee. Mississippi State, Kentucky, them three games, if the Kentucky has Will Levis, then, then all three of them games are losable. Georgia can lose all three of them games. So Georgia got to step it up, got to a faster start. Stephen got to be better. Uh, the old line got to keep doing like they didn't play in the past two second halves. If they do that, there's, if Georgia plays up to Georgia's standards, how they did against Oregon and South Carolina, nobody, I don't think nobody can beat Georgia, even Alabama and Ohio State. So, yeah, Georgia, 42 to 10, 6 0. We're going to a bowl game. <laughs> Uh, but, uh, let's see what Texas and Alabama, man, what kind of call was that at the end of the game? Texas and had a golden opportunity to beat Alabama again. And Texas and was terrible. And T Alabama almost lost again. Good Lord. They want to say Jalen Monroe. I mean, they play their backup quarterback, but so Texas and m So man, it is what it is. But what kind of play call was that, man? Jimbo, I mean, you could have picked any. His 200 play, 200,000 plus play calls he has, he picked that one. I don't know, man. And if you go back and watch, I could be wrong, but Haynes King, he could have t rolled out to the left on this side of the field. Like, you know, he was like, he was facing this way. He could have rolled to that side, and man, he had nothing but green. Well, that's what I saw. He might have had to beat a linebacker or a lineman, but I think he could have ran out, ran him to the corner. I don't know. I could be wrong, but that play call was horrible. Terrible, terrible play call. But it is what it is. Alabama improves to what, 6-0. and oh. They play Tennessee next week. Uh, if Bryce Young don't play next week, Tennessee's going to beat Alabama. But I think I think Bryce Young will play. And I think, I don't know, man. That game's in Tennessee, too. I, that's going to be a good game. Ten watch out for Tennessee. They could beat Alabama, even if Bryce plays. But we'll see. We'll see. Kentucky lost to South Carolina. Will Levis didn't play. I don't know. Uh, who else, what else happened in SEC? Did Florida win? Oh, yeah, they beat Missouri. Well, what can I say? Georgia barely beat Missouri. It is what it is. Uh, what else? What else? What else? What else? What else? What else? O'Connell just looks horrible. They lost 49 to nothing to Texas. Yeah, lost 49 to nothing to Texas. I don't know how that happens. Oklahoma is horrible. I really think, like, Vanderbilt could hang with Oklahoma. I mean, Oklahoma is terrible. Uh, what else? Hey, baseball, Braves. Uh, Braves. They play uh, Philadelphia Phillies in the NLDS round one. Game one is Tuesday uh, at one o'clock, of course. They always play Atlanta in the terrible time slot. So defending champions playing at one o'clock on a Tuesday afternoon. Yeah, it is what it is, though. I think I think Florida. I mean, not Florida. I think the Phillies or the Braves beat the Phillies in like four games. Uh, Mets are playing right now as as of now. Mets are losing two to nothing. If they do lose this game, they will be eliminated. <laughs> That's funny, but. Uh, yeah, that's all. I'm gonna wrap this video up. I'm gonna make a quick video, but I will be making more videos. I'm gonna start out just making one video a week 
on a Sunday, and we'll go from there. Comment below if you've got any opinions or if you just want to chat, chit-chat, let me know. Hope you have a great day, and uh, go dogs.